Today, we are replacing our Philips Aqua Touch Shaver 1000 with lithium batteries. Bought this shaver during a sale previously, but our last shaver unit didn't die until more than a year later. So we kept this dormant in the package for over a year. To our disappointment, the internal batteries refused to be charged up anymore. After 5 minutes of use, the shaver will just die despite us running it through a few recharge cycle. So here it is, we opened it up and attempt to replace the internal nickel metal hydride batteries. Remove 3 screws to access the internal case. The internal casing need to be pried open with the locking tabs, which can be easily broken. Unsolder the 2-cell nickel metal hydride battery pack. Then we decided to replace with two lithium batteries in parallel to extend the battery life since the 602427 lithium battery pack can fit in the 2-cell AAA tray. This battery was originally meant to fit in a Mylan M3 bicycle GPS speedometer. So that's it. Direct replacement from AAA nickel metal hydride to a 2P lithium. We are not worried about the charging, since the original Philips charger is a 4.3 volts 300 milliamps unit. The specifications seem to match charging a 4.2 volts peak lithium cell very closely. Now that this shaver is essentially powered by two pieces of 4.2 volts 400 milliamps battery in parallel, we should get a very long runtime for charge. Let's see how long will this shaver last before it dies again.